वेरी वॉम वेलकम योर वॉचिंग द न्यूज विद मी अनुभूति गौर लेट्स लुक एट वॉट्स मेकिंग हेडलाइंस After being removed from the defence panel, BJP MP Pragya Singh Thakur tenders apology over Godse Patriot remark hurting any sentiment. Says it is condemnable the way remark has been attacked without finding out the details and context. The 49-year-old lawmaker also alleged that she had been called a terrorist by an MP, though there was no evidence against her. It is an attack on my dignity as a woman and parliamentarian. BJP's Nishikant Dubey spoke in favour of Sadhvi Pragya, said calling a woman and member of parliament a terrorist is even worse than murder of Mahatma Gandhi. Congress MLA Govardhan Dangi from Madhya Pradesh has threatened to burn BJP MP. Pragya Singh Thakur over a remark calling Godse a patriot in the Lok Sabha. He said that if Pragya Singh Thakur sets foot in Madhya Pradesh, won't burn her effigy, what will burn her instead? Pragya Singh Thakur has tendered an apology and has claimed that she didn't call Godse a patriot. Her remarks were twisted and taken out of context by the opposition. Shiv Sena says in party mouthpiece Samna that Prime Minister Narendra Modi should cooperate with his younger brother From Maharashtra, the newly appointed Chief Minister Uddhav Thakre, PM Modi had congratulated Shiv Sena chief and his formerly ally after he was sworn in as the Chief Minister of Maharashtra along with the six ministers. The Sena mouthpiece wrote, "The BJP Sena are sharing strained relations in Maharashtra politics, but Narendra Modi and Uddhav Thakre share brotherly ties." BJP corners Congress over Shiv Sena praising Mahatma Gandhi's assassin Nathuram Godse in the past. and wondered if this was the reason why rahul gandhi was ashamed to attend the swearing in ceremony of maharashtra chief minister uddhav thakre rahul gandhi had earlier attacked the bjp over its mp pragya singh thakur's praise for nathuram godse saying her remarks represented the heart and soul of the sarkar party former maharashtra chief minister devin fadnavis summoned by nagpur court devin fadnavis has been accused of concealing information about two criminal matters against him in election affidavit the development came on the day a new shiv sena led government was sworn in maharashtra fadnavis is an mla from nagpur four people have been taken into custody a day after the body of a young veterinarian badly burnt was found near hyderabad the police suspect that she may have been raped Before she was murdered, the 26-year-old vet had gone missing on Wednesday night after she left from her workplace and was headed home. Investigations revealed that on her way, she stopped at the toll booth, parked her bike there, and went to visit a dermatologist in a cab. In a CCTV clip, a bike can be seen near the toll booth on the outskirts of Hyderabad. Rajiv Kumar gets top court notice after CBI appeals against anticipatory bail in the multi-crore Sharda Chit Fund scam case. The apex court seeks this response. A bench headed by Chief Justice S. A. Bobde told the Solicitor General Tushar Mehta that the agency has to convince the top court why custody of former Kolkata Police Commissioner was needed in the case. That's all in this bulletin. Thanks for watching. The news and updates will continue on the other side.